ever been descending toward the airport and suddenly the plane feels like it speeds up again, like you're supposed to be slowing down but the jet suddenly leans forward as if it wants to go faster. That's not the pilot messing up, that's aerodynamics slapping the aircraft awake. Here's the part no one tells passengers as the plane drops into denser air, the drag that was slowing it down at high altitude disappears. At 35,000 feet, the air is thin, sticky and full of drag. Lower down, the jet slices through it cleanly, so cleanly that it naturally starts to accelerate and the autopilot knows it. If the pilots did nothing, the aircraft would pick up speed all by itself because the engines stay at idle but the aerodynamic drag is melting away beneath it. So they have to force the jet to slow down using flaps, speed brakes and steeper profiles. That little push you feel halfway through descent, that's the aircraft dropping into a thicker air layer and the physics changing instantly beneath you. The plane isn't accelerating on purpose, it's losing drag faster than it's losing altitude. The pilots then add drag back in, just to keep the speed legal. So next time the descent suddenly feels faster, instead of slower. Remember, uh, the aircraft's not misbehaving, it's reacting to the atmosphere like a giant aerodynamic seesaw. But tell me, tss, does that mid-descent surge make you curious? Or make you tighten your seatbelt just a little bit more?